Hi, I'm Lisa Von Drasik from the Children's Literature Research Collections of the University of Minnesota. And today for Read This Book we have... Cheryl Fong, Interim Curator for Northwest Architectural Archive. Today I've asked Cheryl to bring me two books about architecture mm -hmm. that we might want to give to people for the holidays. That's correct. I've brought along two books. Um, both give you an armchair tour of Minnesota architecture in the 20th century. So in your lap you mm -hmm. have? I have a beautiful book just published this summer. Um, Edwin H. Lundy, Five Decades, A Journey of Art and Architecture by Peter O'Toole. So this is a book about a singular architect. That's correct. And um, tell me a little bit about that architect. Well, Edwin Lundy uh, started his work uh, under the auspices of, of Masqueray, right? The one who did the Cathedral of St. Paul and is known for his churches in Minnesota. Mm -hmm. um, so Lundy was very prolific and Ooh. loved to draw. He focused on cabins and residences. And this book is drawn heavily from our material in the archives. And you see that he's shown um, renderings, elevations, floor plans, and then they really come alive with his descriptions and photographs of the featured commissions. Lovely. And I did have a, you said our archives. Yes. So can anyone who's interested in architecture come to your archives? Anybody who's interested in seeing architecture can certainly come to the archives. And see the original primary source and documents. see the original primary source document. And you know, that brings an interesting thing up. You know, for all the historical uh, styles that Lundy drew on, he didn't travel much. He gleaned all of his information from books, and we have his working library in the collection. Oh, that is amazing. Mm -hmm. Now, one of the things that my family is very interested in is mid-century ah. modern. Yes. We moved to Minnesota four years ago, and we are living in a house that was built in 1950. And your, this book hmm. was a special request from my husband for his holiday gifts. Yes, Minnesota Modern Architecture and Life at Mid-Century by Larry Millette. Can you tell me a little bit about the author, Larry Millette? Well, Mary, Larry Millette crosses over between Sherlock Holmes and architecture, which is where he got his start. And so this book, can you tell me a little bit about it? Yeah, Minnesota uh, Modern features uh, that century uh, post-war, uh, although it gives you a little bit of background information. As you're flipping through it, you see both commerce, corporations, and residences, as well as places of worship. And um, again, are there materials in our collection? Yes, although he drew on a much larger uh, number of repositories. And uh, so yes, some of the items, um, primary items we have in our collection at NAA. And you can browse a book like this for the pictures? Absolutely, for inspiration. I mean, this is, this is the hip, uh, mid-century modern aesthetic. And between these two books, you really get a feel of the environment that is... Minnesota. Ah, thank you, Cheryl. You're welcome. That's all the time we have for this Read This Book.